Recent reports from China indicate that CL, currently the largest battery manufacturer in the world, has unveiled a new generation of sodium ion batteries with a staggering 1,200 kilowatts charging capability. This development marks a significant leap in battery technology and could have profound implications for the electric vehicle industry. Sodium ion batteries, once seen as a potential but limited alternative to lithium ion technology, are rapidly emerging as a viable competitor due to their lower cost, faster charging capabilities, and steadily improving energy density. The new battery pack from CTL appears to be an upgrade of its free void design, which previously combined sodium and lithium cells. However, indications suggest that the latest generation may rely entirely on sodium cells. The charging rate of 1,200 kilowatts or 12C represents a level of speed that was previously considered unattainable. This kind of performance has the potential to disrupt not only the battery market but also the broader electric vehicle industry, as such advancements drastically reduce charging times, improving the convenience and viability of electric vehicles for mainstream consumers. CL is not alone in driving this innovation. Other major players in China such as BYD are also advancing at a rapid pace. This puts battery manufacturers in South Korea and the United States under increasing pressure to keep up. The pace of development in China is particularly noteworthy, as it underscores the country's dominance in the battery sector and its determination to stay ahead of global competitors. A key example of this new technology in use is Huawei's IEO EV line. The ITO M6, produced through a joint venture between Huawei and Ceres, will feature CL's sodium-containing battery pack. This joint brand, operational since 2021, combines series manufacturing expertise and platform design with Huawei's software and components. Vehicles equipped with these sodium-ion batteries are expected to enter the market soon, bringing cutting-edge charging technology to consumers. The capabilities of these batteries are particularly striking. A slide from a recent presentation highlighted the 12C charging feature, meaning that a battery could theoretically achieve a full charge in as little as 3 to 4 minutes. Such speeds represent a breakthrough comparable to the leap from dial-up internet to high-speed broadband, setting a new benchmark for energy storage systems. Two configurations of the vehicle are planned, one using a sodium-based URV battery and another fully electric model utilizing CL's advanced GIN battery pack. The Gylan battery pack, also known as the CTP CELTOAC 3.0 comma, is CL's third-generation CELTA pack design. This pack achieves an energy density similar to Tesla's 4,680 cylindrical cells at approximately 255 WH per kilogram. What sets the Gielin pack apart is CL's claim that it can fit more cells per unit compared to Tesla's design, potentially increasing the vehicle's overall range. Early reports suggest that vehicles equipped with the Glyn battery pack could achieve ranges of up to 1,000 kilometers on a single charge making range anxiety virtually obsolete for most drivers. There is also mention of a condensed sodium battery featuring MP2.0 thermoelectric separation technology. This condensed battery is said to have an energy density of 450 WH per kilogram, which is substantially higher than standard lithium-ion cells. A battery of this caliber with an 80 kWh capacity could provide over 800 miles or roughly 1,300 kilometers of driving range. While these condensed batteries are not yet widely deployed in consumer vehicles, their introduction would represent a seismic shift in electric vehicle performance. Perhaps the most revolutionary aspect of this technology is the 12C charging capability. A 100 kWh battery pack capable of handling 1.2 megawatts of power could be fully charged in under 10 minutes. This rate of energy transfer is virtually unprecedented and would require significant advancements in charging infrastructure. From power grid enhancements to new cooling and cable technologies, the Shun YNC battery, the latest innovation from CL, is a testament to the company's relentless pursuit of progress. The first generation of Shun YNC was already considered one of the most advanced lithium iron phosphate batteries in the world, but the second generation pushes beyond even that reputation. With the ability to exceed 1.3 MW in charging speed, it challenges the capabilities of any battery currently on the market including those from leading Western manufacturers. This rapid development raises questions about infrastructure readiness. Charging stations capable of delivering such massive power levels are not yet widespread. Most high-speed chargers today max out at 350 kilowatts, 
a fraction of what these new batteries can handle. The industry will need to adapt quickly to make full use of these capabilities. Innovations in grid technology, energy storage, and thermal management will all be necessary to support the shift to ultra-fast charging. The implications go beyond passenger vehicles. Batteries with these characteristics could revolutionize freight and logistics, electric trucks, buses, and heavy machinery. Sectors where charging time and energy density are critical stand to benefit immensely from sodium-ion technology. The ability to recharge large battery packs in minutes rather than hours could make electric freight vehicles as efficient as their diesel counterparts while reducing operating costs. Additionally, the advantages of sodium-ion batteries extend to grid storage solutions. Their fast charge-discharge cycles, low cost and tolerance for temperature extremes make them ideal for stabilizing renewable energy sources like wind and solar. As the world transitions toward a low-carbon future, affordable large-scale energy storage will be critical, and sodium batteries are well-positioned to fill that role. The rise of sodium-ion batteries also presents an opportunity to address some of the environmental and geopolitical challenges associated with lithium-ion batteries. Sodium is far more abundant and evenly distributed globally than lithium, reducing reliance on a limited number of mining regions and mitigating supply chain vulnerabilities. Furthermore, sodium-ion batteries are generally considered safer, with a lower risk of thermal runaway and fire hazards compared to their lithium-ion counterparts. This makes them particularly attractive for applications where safety is paramount, such as in residential energy storage or public transportation systems. Another critical advantage is cost efficiency. The materials required for sodium ion batteries, primarily sodium, iron, and manganese, are significantly cheaper and more readily available than the cobalt, nickel, and lithium used in traditional batteries. This cost advantage could accelerate the adoption of electric vehicles in price-sensitive markets making sustainable transportation accessible to a broader demographic. Analysts predict that mass production of sodium ion batteries could drive prices down by as much as 30 to 40 percent compared to current lithium ion packs, further tipping the scales in favor of electric mobility. However, challenges remain. While energy density has improved dramatically, sodium ion batteries still lag behind the highest performing lithium ion variants, particularly in premium electric vehicles where range is a key selling point. Manufacturers will need to strike a balance between cost, performance, and energy density to cater to different market segments. Additionally, the existing lithium-ion supply chain and manufacturing infrastructure are deeply entrenched, meaning the transition to sodium-ion technology will require substantial investment and retooling of production lines, Industry observers are closely watching how legacy automakers and battery producers respond to this disruption. Some may choose to license CL's technology or form joint ventures to integrate sodium-ion batteries into their vehicles. Others might accelerate in-house research to develop competing sodium-ion or solid-state battery solutions. Regardless of the approach, the competitive landscape is set to evolve rapidly with innovation cycles shortening and collaboration between tech firms, automakers, and energy companies becoming increasingly crucial. Beyond automotive applications, the implications for renewable energy integration are profound. Sodium-ion batteries' ability to charge and discharge rapidly makes them ideal for smoothing out the intermittent nature of solar and wind power. Large-scale storage farms equipped with these batteries could enhance grid stability, reduce reliance on fossil fuel-based peaker plants, and enable higher penetrations of renewables. Countries investing heavily in clean energy, such as those in the European Union and parts of Asia, may find sodium-ion technology a game-changer for achieving their decarbonization targets. In the long term, the success of sodium-ion batteries will hinge on scalability, performance consistency, and consumer acceptance. Early adopters such as fleet operators and commercial vehicle manufacturers are likely to be the first to fully leverage the technology's benefits. As real-world data on durability and life cycle performance accumulates, broader consumer confidence is expected to follow. CL's breakthrough underscores a broader trend. The energy storage sector is entering an era of diversification, where no single technology dominates. Lithium-ion will remain relevant for high-performance applications, while sodium-ion, solid-state, and other emerging chemistries carve out niches based on their unique strengths. This diversification will ultimately benefit consumers, fostering competition, driving down costs, and accelerating the global transition to sustainable energy. The coming months will be pivotal, 
If CL delivers on its promises the ripple effects will be felt across industries from transportation to utilities. Policymakers, investors and competitors alike must prepare for a future where energy storage is faster, cheaper and more adaptable than ever before. One thing is certain. The race to power the 21st century has just taken a dramatic turn. The next few years will determine how quickly sodium ion technology can be scaled for mass adoption. CL has signaled that these advanced batteries will begin appearing in electric vehicles within the next six months. If this timeline holds true, it will be one of the fastest commercial rollouts of a new battery technology in history. The combination of rapid charging, high range, and lower cost will make these vehicles highly competitive and could reshape consumer expectations worldwide. International competition is certain to intensify. Companies in South Korea, Japan, Europe, and the United States will need to accelerate their research and development efforts to keep up with the pace set by China. Strategic partnerships, licensing deals, and new manufacturing techniques may emerge as other players attempt to close the gap. The unveiling of CL's sodium-ion battery marks a turning point in the evolution of energy storage. With charging speeds exceeding 1,200 kilowatts, energy densities approaching that of high-end lithium cells, and the promise of significant cost reductions, Sodium batteries are poised to transform the electric vehicle market and beyond. This is not just an incremental improvement, it is a leap forward that could redefine what is possible for clean energy technologies.